banding together in support of their friend. Remembering Deep Indajit Singh, otherwise known as Deep, who tragically drowned on Hobart's waterfront on Monday night. Deep was just an absolutely kind-hearted person, which um, as soon as he walked in the door, had a smile on his face every time he came to work. His contribution here at the restaurant was always, was always done in a positive manner. Mr Singh was originally from India, moving to Melbourne, then Hobart three years ago to work and study. His friends and colleagues still coming to terms with his death. We got the, the call on Monday night and my heart dropped, Simon's heart dropped as well. We just didn't know what, what was that going did. on. It was, it was such a shock. The 27-year-old and a woman were sitting on the water's edge next to Franklin Wharf when they were allegedly pushed into the water in what police say was a bungled attempted robbery. Police say the pair entered the water here where there are three safety ladders nearby while the nearest life buoy is further down the wharf. The woman swam to safety and raised the alarm, but Mr Singh couldn't swim and was not able to be revived after he was pulled from the water. The support that we've received, or that they've received, and, and, and deep in particular from the community, has just been overwhelming and this is, it gives you such a great mm. sense of pride that, to be a Tasmanian. Four people have been charged over the incident. Two 17-year-olds, a 19-year-old man and a 25-year-old woman have been jointly charged with aggravated robbery, while a 17-year-old man from Goodwood has also been charged with manslaughter. They will remain in custody ahead of their court appearance tomorrow. Liz Gwynn, ABC News.